Welcome back, everyone. A handful of guys are about to hit the stage and strut their stuff at Bayport High School, all to capture the title, the prestigious title of <laughs> Mr. Bayport. Yeah, the annual Bayport Guy Pageant will test the guys' talents, humor, and overall presentation, and all raising money for the school's DECA program. Joining us now are some of the organizers and contestants. We've got a full studio this yeah. morning, so I'm going to have you all just really kind of quickly introduce yourselves. Uh, I'm Abby Zeidler. My name is Andrew Adderhold. I'm Jack Anderson. My name is Megan Neistad. I'm Andrew Thomas. And I'm Emma Soltz. Well, thank you right. so Welcome. much for Welcome. getting yeah. up early yeah. and joining us. So tell us about the Bayport Guy pageant. What's going to be going on? Um, so it's sort of like a mock pageant of like a beauty pageant. So um, the boys are just going to be doing some humorous things. They're doing like a costume portion. There's a talent and then a questionnaire where we just ask them like random questions just to see if they can get them or not. <laughs> um, it's pretty funny. Uh, I mean, we do sort of promote it as a comedic show, so anything, mm -hmm. like, it's for families, things like that. So we're really excited. Um, it's it's going to be fun. <laughs> okay. And you're raising funds, obviously, so tell us a little bit about that, where the, you know, where the funds go to uh, and, and how they're used through the DECA program. Um, so this, the pageant is one of our largest fundraisers for uh, our DECA chapter, and we use that um, for most of our competition uh, travel costs. All of our competitions, except for the district one, which was on January 3rd, are um, away. We spend nights um, in Nashville or Lake Geneva, um, so we want to make sure that we are able to help our chapter members pay for those sort of activities, and they also go to um, campaign, well, other campaigns, and um, yeah, just promotional materials. Okay, and this is all organized by students. Why don't you tell us the work you put into this? We've really been organizing the event since September. We held our first meeting kind of towards the end of the month, and ever since then it's been organizing and planning and having practices. So we're really proud of all the guys um, who are contestants in the show for putting in all the work and effort that they have, and we're really excited to see it pay off during the show. Okay. We've been seeing some of the video, obviously, from, from past competitions, uh, which, which looks hilarious. But so, all right, you guys are here. You're going to give us a little indication of, of what you have in store or what's, what's going on? What do you plan for yourselves? Uh, well, I can't say too much. Yeah, but, uh, yeah, for sure, yeah. I will say that uh, as part of my talent, uh, there will be treadmills involved. So that's all I can say. Oh, ah, all right. Well, there you go. Interesting. <clears throat> I'm really big into theater, so for my talent, I'm singing "If I Could Tell Her" from Dear Evan Hansen. Oh, very cool. cool. Very cool. And uh, most people kind of know me as an athlete. Uh, <laughs> no usually see me uh, sing or dance before. It's be a new side of me. People don't know, uh, but I'm gonna be singing a uh, country song as well as perform performing a classic dance. Very oh, fun. Yeah. So yeah. why did you guys want to actually go up on stage and be able to do this? Why did you, why did you think it was important? Uh, I thought it was an important uh, cause, a good fundraiser for DECA. I'm involved in DECA myself, so that was very important for me to be involved in this. Very cool. Very cool. Um, and uh, I guess, you know, for, for those folks who want to come out, kind of give us some of the details. How can people come out, see the show, enjoy all the fun? Um, so it's going to be on January 22nd in the Bayport uh, PAC. Um, tickets are going to be $7 at the door, um, and it starts at 7 p.m. It's going to run until about 9-ish. Um, so it'll be two hours. There's an intermission in between. We'll have a bake sale um, right. for any appetites in the middle. Nice. Yeah. yeah. Okay, and we do have more details about this. It is coming up, the Bayport Guy Pageant, January 22nd, 7 o'clock, as you said, Bayport PAC, $5 in advance, $7 at the door. So if you're looking to have a good time and watch a lot of fun and help <laughs> a local school, this is the way to do it. Stay with Local 5 this morning, everyone.